Sheriff, yes. your blood sugar was about 300 yes. daily, and now it's normal. Mm -hmm. Your weight was 50 pounds heavier. Yeah. How'd you get the miracle? <laughs> you, I, no, I am so grateful. Right. I can't begin, you saved my life. I did not know when I came in here mm -hmm. that you would be saving my and life. And you didn't know you were diabetic when you I first came not, out? No, I was sick. Mm -hmm. I was depleted. I was so exhausted. My memory was just, I, I couldn't think straight. And no one had mentioned diabetes in all the previous doctors, too? Uh, they said that my sugar level was up. They said that, um, it didn't impact you, you know, I should lose some weight. But, you know, I was No one recommended medication at that point? No one treated you? No. no. It was early? Yeah, and when I came in here, I actually had been with you prior. I had dropped 40 some odd pounds. But I fell and I tore my shoulder and I got sidetracked. Did we call you and try to get you back in? Yes, you did. All right, well, here All right, I am. Here's your lesson. Mm -hmm. If you don't stay where you're at, then That's hair right. falls out, then your your fingers lose all the feeling yes. immediately. That kind of blood sugar can lead to an amputation well, a little, and heart attack. I came in here to get back to what I should be doing. In the meantime, you had taken my blood work. Mm -hmm. A week later, I walk back in and find out that all of my numbers are insane. Yeah, they were. So the truth of the matter is, it's a miracle that I came in when I did, because right. if I hadn't, I'd probably be dead. Or in the ICU. God you could knows. have gone into comatose. God and, uh, knows. The sugar but was so ridiculous. God knows. But in mm -hmm. one month, you got me down mm -hmm. from 12.10 on my A1C mm -hmm. to 10.2. Mm -hmm. And every month thereafter, my numbers kept dropping, not just my A1C, but my triglycerides, I mean everything. I'm, I don't know what to say, but I'm... You got a miracle. 